Hello, my name is Elizabeth Pellen. I am the creative director of Skull and Bones, and I'm here to break down the Skull and Bones Ubisoft Forward trailer. This could be the greatest heist ever. In Skull and Bones, as you explore the world and rise your infamy through epic naval battles, you will loot and unlock a large variety of vanity sets that you can complete or all mix to create a unique look for your pirate captain and ship. In our game, you can also customize the look of your crew. This customization currently changes as a set and not yet individually. Our game has a wide variety of weapons for you to customize and here are some quick examples of a few different types of weapons like Spike Culverine, Caronade and Long Gun. Long Gun, for example, offers long distance shots but requires precision. While the Caronade provides very quick reload speed but less damage output. Each of those weapons have some element damage type which has bonuses and minuses to different armor types of four enemies. That's a Ballista. It's commonly equipped as a bow of your ship and shoots a singular long-range high damage arrow at a time. Like all weapons in our game, it can be upgraded and has several elemental types like fire, piercing, and even healing. And you, Kali, will play the villain. Those sails belong to the Dutch merchant company. What I can say about this faction is that their fleets transport the most valuable cargo through the dangerous waters of Indian Ocean. That faction can spot any gangs of pirates from a long distance and hit multiple ships at the same time with their deadly mortars. Fire! Ready your ship. Historically, pirates did transform their ship to outsmart preys bigger than them. They could break walls below the deck as an example or ballast the hull to improve the stability of a ship. So the system of armor is our interpretation of how pirates can put together a ship based on their enemy strengths. Every weapon and damage type will have an armor that can counter it. So each armor is efficient at protecting your hull and cargo from specific faction techniques. In our game, we have three main categories of ship. Cargo, navigation and combat. The cargo ships give you advantage in terms of weight capacity. The navigation ships are faster and easier to maneuver, while the combat ships come with more cannon ports, which allows players to equip more weapons and deal more damage. Our ships also have a cool figure heads that you can choose to equip. You will be able to find them throughout the game as part of your progression or buy them in our store. Gird your loins. Pets are also confirmed for the game at launch. You will find them as part of your progression, but you can also discover the vanity sets for them as you progress and through our store. And seize that fucking convoy! Attacking forts in our game is risky business. As part of the fort's defenses, they will send up a signal flare when the gatekeepers spot a danger at the horizon. This is their way of calling for reinforcements. Players will expect a fleet of enemy ships coming towards them and they will have to make the choice of either fleeing or staying to fight for the plunder. The longer you'll resist waves of enemies, the bigger the bounty will be for you taking. Destiny is calling. And our names are on her lips. Fire! They'll sink in a moment! Rocket launchers can also be equipped on our ships as secondary weapons. It is one of my favorite weapons because it works better in a fast-paced naval battle as it has a wide trajectory and allows projectiles to hit moving targets for more efficiency compared to a single-shot weapon. So as you can see, these are not your modern day target lock torpedoes that you will find in our game. The torpedoes we have usually have a very long range, but the accuracy may not be as great as other weapons. However, it's really fun to use. Like mentioned before, with our weapon counter system, you can equip certain armor to increase your defense against such weapons. Different weapons inflict one of the different types of damage. Explosive, piercing, fire, flooding, crushing, tearing or blunt. 
Each type can result in immense damage. All our damage depending on your opponent's armor material. Thank you for watching Ubisoft Forward and we can't wait for you to sail the seas with us this November 8th. Fire!